I'd be shocked if they don't take a center at some point in this draft, Joe. And I doubt they take a center with the 33rd pick. So I'm guessing they grab one in the third round, either with the 65th pick or the 73rd pick. I'm also guessing they need a more zone scheme center mm. with Slovak's offense. Who do you like in the third round, high third round as a center? Yeah, just a couple names that come to mind. The center class, first of all, is a lot of really good depth. And there's a lot of players that I think can plug in to be high-level starters. I, I think John Michael Schmitz has been a, a big name in this class, and I, I don't know if he's really up to that first-round billing that some people have painted him as, but still a, a somebody who can step in as a starter could go somewhere in the second or third round. Luke Whipler and Joe Tipman, uh, the two younger guys, Tipman from Wisconsin, Ohio State, uh, for Whipler are two to pay attention to in the third round. I have Ricky Stromberg ranked as my number one center in this class. I, I think that he is a really smart, experienced player, an older prospect. Um, for whatever reason, I, I had Stromberg on my show, and I, I've also heard feedback from scouts that for some strange reason, the NFL sees him more as a early day three, late day two pick. And I, I think that he might be the Creed Humphrey of this class. If you remember a couple of years ago, Creed Humphrey out of Oklahoma, goes way later than we all thought. And he's one of the best centers in the NFL right now. He is a really good starting player. So I, I would pay close attention to Ricky Stromberg. And if I wanted to just throw out a couple of other names that were more day three, uh, Braden Daniels from Utah played left tackle. He's on the leaner side. I think he benefits bumping inside to guard or center. He's something to pay attention to. Uh, and then I would also throw out there Jarrett Patterson from Notre Dame, who's an experienced guy played guard this past season, but primarily played center in his career and is going to be a best fitted center at the next level. You're listening to Houston sports talk.